up guys, Stefan from Japan, I'm in the Ikebukuro region, uh, I'm at the Nabezo uh, restaurant, it's a shabu shabu and uh, sukiyaki all you can eat, there's a line as you can see, so uh, I'm gonna wait and uh, let's go eat some shabu shabu. Uh, coffee bar, coffee mocha, Little things to drink. Tea you can drink. More drinks you can shut up. Okay. There's a coke. Fanta melon. That's what I do. Fanta melon. And you can get some Celtic too. Hey guys, there's a lot of people here, so I'm a bit shy to uh, film everything. But uh, this is the uh, shabu shabu sukiyaki all you can eat. I got some Japanese pork, some Japanese uh, beef, some wagyu, and some beef tongue. Uh, I made a sauce with a bit of uh, garlic, maiko, uh, hot oil, sesame oil, um, green onions. And my intake of veggies. Itadakimasu! Oh well, it seems I made a mistake here. I was sure I pressed the uh, record button on the camera, but it seems that I pressed the take a picture button instead. Anyways, for the uh, second round, I ordered some more uh, Wagyu, the Japanese beef. I ordered two racks and I stuffed my face with it. I really, really enjoyed the sukiyaki. Uh, because it was my first time and uh, I didn't know if I was gonna like it or not because your dipping sauce is a beaten egg that's it so you just cook your meat in the uh, sweet broth and then dip it in the raw egg and eat it so I tried it and I really loved it there was some uh, milk matcha tea so I couldn't resist I took a cup just for me and uh, for ice cream uh, there's some uh, chocolate raspberry, which I'm gonna take, and some peach ice cream. Uh, there are two other flavors that uh, one that uh, I think everybody knows it's uh, green tea, but the other one uh, I think it's milk banana. If I have some spot in my stomach, I'm just gonna take a small, just a small bite to see what it tastes like. So I keep uh, eating. There's a lot of people and. Because I was on a, on a counter, like a timer, I mean, uh, I didn't want to waste too much time uh, doing the video. But uh, just so far, everything was super delicious. It was my first time having a, a sukiyaki, and I loved it. That's the chocolate and raspberry ice cream. Let's dig in. Peach ice cream. Peach ice cream. Sorry guys, I started to begin uh, this one. Uh, this is half green tea and a half milk and banana ice cream. Um, some of you that knows me, uh, I really, really love to eat chocolate. So uh, I'm just taking a little small bite of uh, each just to see what it tastes like. But uh, I'm switching back to chocolate and I'm gonna all you can eat that ice cream. Okay guys, now I'm in the uh, mixing business, that's chocolate and raspberry topped with some milk and banana ice cream. It was so, so light, so good, I had to try uh, to mix them together, I'm pretty sure it's gonna taste good. <coughs> okay, let me explain to you the menu. You've got 100 minutes to eat everything you can, it's all you can eat. And depending of the course you get access to that kind of meat or not for an extra 200 yen you can get two soup so if you want to try shabu shabu and sukiyaki that's what i did then for 300 yen extra you can get access to all the soft drinks all the coffee teas whatever you want everything that doesn't contain alcohol there was an extra option for alcohol, but uh, I don't really drink when I eat, so I didn't take it. 
and that's pretty much it so i took the best uh, course meal for the meat because i wanted to have access to the japanese wagyu japanese beef and the japanese pork so i paid for that and i was uh, given the possibility to get the beef tongue as well with that price so that's pretty much what i did so if you want to eat the best shabu shabu slash sukiyaki come to that place it's called Nabezo. best shabu shabu i ate in my life and the best sukiyaki uh, i ever ate it was very delicious and if you check on the internet they have a very very good rate depending on the website you check i check a couple and they were all giving it some uh, good uh, rating so anyways uh, that that was the menu explained to you Oh yeah, forget, for uh, 500 yen extra, you can you could get 30 minutes extra. So let's say you're a group, you talk a lot and everything, you're not getting enough time to eat, then you could pay an extra so you can keep on eating. Isn't that amazing? I mean, that amazed me. This guy is amazing. It's a Beat Mania kind of uh, arcade. It's actually Beat Mania's 2DX26. Watch him play, it's amazing. enjoyed that beat mania jedi master uh, dude at the arcade uh, i did okay uh, i forgot to explain one last thing about the menu and that's uh, for all the menu i saw in japan they often put l.o which stands for last order so let's say the restaurant closed at uh, 11 at night they put the last order at let's say 10:30. So if you get there, make sure you get there before the last order because you're not going to be able to have a seat and uh, get your food. Anyways, uh, as usual, if you like the video, give it some thumbs up. I'll leave the location of this place in the description box down below as usual. And uh, if you're not already subscribed, press that subscribe button. All right. So until the next video, take care of yourself, guys. See ya!